Hello. Good afternoon. Okay, so I went to, I have said it many times, I hate going to Hobby Lobby, but it is the only craft place in my area, so I begrudgingly go every time. But anyway, it's the best place to find the craft things that my daughter needed for her school supplies. And even though I do not appreciate or agree with their stance on certain religious uh, beliefs over um, birth control and stuff like that, uh, you know, I got to overlook it because in, in the long run, it's for my daughter's, you know, schooling. So anyway, <clears throat> so I got a paper pad. I saw it. It wasn't on sale, so I had to use a 40% coupon. So I got it for five and a half instead of eight. I about freaked when I saw it was $8. I was like, what? Eight bucks? But anyway, so it says Stargazer. And I, at first I thought, oh, cool. Uh, same name as uh, Captain Picard's first ship. But, you know, anyway. <laughs> Only a nerd like me, I guess, would think that. But anyway, this is kind of neat. Um, so I just figured I would make a video showing this little paper pack. And it's just a four by six, I believe. And uh, let's see. And it's cardstock type paper. It's only one sided. Uh, generally, I have never seen these, you know, these thick pads being more than, you know, just one side. So anyway, and I figured let's go ahead and look at it together and see how, you know, see if some of these designs are kind of neat. So this one is, uh, yeah, the 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 stars on here and i think the lines yeah the lines as well it's hard to see actually i don't know why there you go um are holographic for the constellations so let's go ahead and skip to the next page or you know the next selection oh that's kind of neat so anyway what i intend to do with these is of course make paper beads out of them and I'm just going to go through all the designs. This one's just um, uh, print. There's no there's no foil on this one. I can't see any foil as I peer over my cell phone. <laughs> so anyway, on to the next one. Ooh, that's going to be pretty. Um, I have made um, many paper beads with this material before. Um, I had this one that has blue designs and they all ended up like those um, potteries that have the blue paint on them. That's what those beads kind of reminded me of when I had made them with this type of paper before. Uh, but anyway, so let's continue on. Yeah, that's kind of cool. I like that. That'll make some pretty neat beads, I think. Uh, I like the colors on that. <clears throat> Excuse me. And let's see, this one is just space or, you know, a nebula maybe or whatever. And uh, there is no foil on that one, but I like that. that that's pretty. I like that one. Ooh, bubbles. Nope. Planets? Planets maybe, I suppose. First I thought bubbles. Uh, there's no foil on this one either. Yeah, I can't can't see any foil. I thought maybe the little stars would be in the background would be foil, but they're not. This is just a regular print too, but I kind of like that one. Maybe they're moons. I don't know. Anyway, let's continue on. And there are, let's see how many there are. Um, I don't know if they're all that way. I didn't really, haven't really been counting, but there's one, two, three, four. There are four of each kind of, um, each pattern. So there's this one. Ooh, this one's kind of cool. It's almost like that tie-dye paper that I um, was working in earlier, couple, or no, yeah, earlier last year. Anyway, I really like those colors. Those are pretty colors. I think that'll make some pretty cool um, beads. Ooh, look at this one. This one's kind of neat too. Uh, little stars, yeah. Stars, and of course you can see it's hollow. So that's, that one's kind of neat. Oof. 
Oh, I like this one too. Look at that. That's kind of neat. I like the design in this one. I really, I think that one's gonna make some really neat beads. Oops. Oh, I did grab it the right. Let's see what this one is. Oh, Phases of the Moon. That's kind of neat. I kind of like that. That'll be interesting too. Um, I think that one will be mostly black with just a little bit of the hollow shining through. I'm not sure actually, but yeah, that'll be kind of neat. Ooh, I like this one too. Uh, this one does not appear, oops, sorry. This one does not appear to have any hollow on it, but I really like that one. Uh, yeah, that one's pretty. I almost don't even want to rip this one up. That one's kind of pretty. I really like it. <clears throat> Excuse me. And this, ooh, this one's pretty too. No hollow on this one either. Um, but yeah, that one's, I love the color on this. Like a, a sea green, teal. I don't know what color you'd want to call it. But anyway, let's continue on. Ooh, this one will be a pretty one too. I don't see any, nope, this one's not hollow either. Uh, that's kind of pretty looking. I love those colors together. Um, yep, oops. All right, and this one is unicorns. Blech. Don't really care for unicorns. But anyway, that one will make pretty neat looking, maybe black beads with, you know, just hints of the hollow sticking through. <clears throat> Ooh, this one will be another nice pretty one. I like all these ones that, you know, have that marble look to them. That'll really be kind of a neat, neat bead. And there's no hollow on that one either. Oh, another constellation one. Uh, yeah, this one has this one has hollow on it, but you know, there's they're not. I guess they're not really connected. So, but it's you know stars. I guess so. That's kind of neat. <clears throat> Ooh, this one's gonna be pretty too. No hollow on this one either. It's okay. I don't really need that. Or foil, I guess, is what they've been calling it, but it's basically holographic. Uh, yeah, I like that. Ooh, this one's going to make pretty beads, too. I kind of like that. It's like, um, what is that stone that has those layers of colors in it? Like an agate? That's pretty. Is that the last one? Nope. Here's the last one, I think. Nope, there's more in there. One more, I think. But this one will be kind of interesting. Uh, see, it's too short this way, but the pattern does go this way. Um, this stripe would end up being making a stripe bead if I did roll them this way, but I don't think there's enough there to roll them this direction. You know, cause I've never actually rolled anything that's only four inches tall. So, um, because I always just, I'll, I'd roll it this way, but I don't think that'll be as good of a pattern as this. So I don't know if I'll do those ones or not. I don't know. Ooh, this is a pretty one too. Uh, yeah, that one's holographic as well. I like the pattern in that. And let's find out if that's the last one. And it is. That is the last one. So that's what this uh, Stargazer uh, paper pack is. And yeah, I really like it. So here's a up close of it. 80 sheets, 20 designs for each. Oh, it says right there. <laughs> oh, and it's four and a half by six and a half. I thought it was four inches by six. Oh, nice. Well, those would work nice for like, you know, if you were making a, <clears throat> a inserts for a photo album and this you use this as the mat for the photos to go on. That'd be kind of neat. But, I don't know. Anyway, uh, let's see. Do, do, do. None, none of that is important. But anyway, like I said, I didn't pay that price. I got, I used a 40% a discount. But anyway, yeah, this was Stargazer. And this at some point will be some beads. Um, I really like all the patterns in this. All right. Uh, let me know if you, uh, you bought this pack too or... Um, if you buy the, I mean, I assume that this is also available in the 12 by 12 as well. 
because uh, usually they are, but this was on the end cap and I just happened to see it and I was like, oh, sweet, I'll just, you know, I'll get that. But anyway, okay, so uh, this was my latest paper pack that I bought, which my daughter was like, mom, you don't really need anymore. And I'm like, I know, but she's like, but it's pretty. And I said, I know. <laughs> so I have been trying not, I don't buy any papers. This is like the paper, most paper I've bought in, in since uh, I was gonna do the Christmas cards <laughs> last year. So I have, I've, been, I've doing, been doing pretty good on not buying paper. But anyway, okay, thanks for watching, bye.